There is a huge need for shelter in San Diego. Johnny Oxera is the founder and CEO of Haitian Refugee Community Center. As a former refugee, he knows what it's like to be dropped off on the streets with nowhere to go. When they get released, they don't know English, they don't know where to go, what to do. Oxera is currently helping 300 Haitian refugees, but he says the biggest challenge is not having enough shelter for them. Right now, dozens of refugees are crammed into this house in City Heights. Well, we've been working with these refugees for a minute. Terry Lindley is the co-founder of LoveWorks, a humanitarian aid nonprofit. The organization is helping to fix up the house to make it safer to live in. We have a lot of people already on the street and we don't need any more people on the street. The house is owned by Fairmont Community Church. There are asbestos issues, broken windows, and the paint used on the house contains lead, which poses health risks. Last year, the city cited the property for drainage issues. Uh, when we started, it was cabinets, water damage. Chris Mayu with LoveWorks says so far they've updated the kitchen and bathrooms, fixed the drainage issues, and installed new appliances, including a water heater. They were heating up water in a bucket and taking bucking showers. The nonprofit has created a GoFundMe to continue the project in hopes of giving families a safe space to stay. We're not just helping them with shelter, but we were helping them with social services, with immigration, because a lot of them not even know what asylum means. In City Heights, Nia Watson, ABC 10 News.